Today, I'm going to be recreating LeBron's best shots from level 1 to 100, starting off with this game-winning buzzer beater against Toronto. So here we go. The first attempt of this shot, LeBron! Wasn't really the floater that we wanted. Honestly, bro, this might take a few tries. Boys, here we go. LeBron! Oh, my goodness. I don't even know if that counts, but that was nasty. Second three. Oh. Throws up the floater. Oh, Good night, Cleveland. That is for you. So, boys, yes, it wasn't the exact same shot, but we are going to go ahead and check it off because it is level one. As we move on further into the levels, it gets a lot more difficult to emulate some of these shots. So, let's move on. Next level. Let's get it. Guys, because we completed level one, we are going to go ahead and add Bruce Brown to the Los Angeles Lakers. And what I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video is that every level that we actually end up beating, we get to add a player onto the Lakers roster. And at the end of the video, we are going to try to win a championship with that team. And if we fail to do so, we are going to give away a LeBron James Lakers jersey. So let's get into the next level. Let's see what we got next. Let's get to it. Now, guys, this next level, we have this ferocious dunk that LeBron had playing against his former team and against some of his former teammates. We got to recreate this. Let's get to it. We need to recreate the ferocious dunk that LeBron had in. Okay, that was not a great first attempt. Oh, boys, a bad first attempt. Attempt number two. Okay, you know what? That was pretty nasty, but I'm not going to go ahead and count that. I want an even crazier dunk. I want to end Kevin Love's career. I mean, boys, this is only the second challenge, and I'm kind of struggling. I mean, yes, we got a poster, but it wasn't good enough. And now right there, it's also not good enough. Good move, but it just doesn't qualify to check off this level. I mean, look, man, trying to get the dunk on the right dude is definitely a difficult thing to do. Oh, yeah, right here. I feel it. Come on. Kevin Love, come guard me. Come guard me. Good. 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 Oh my goodness, LeBron James. This man is flying, bro. He's literally flying, but I don't know if any of these count. I feel like I've done enough, but I want to see him fall to the floor. But just keep in mind, this is only the second level. We have so many more. And oh my goodness, you know what, bro? I'm not going to lie. He was on his backside there. That man, Richard Jefferson, I know it's not the right player to dunk over. We needed to dunk over Kevin Love, but he was on his backside. We got the animation we needed. I feel like we can actually go ahead and check this level off. Boys, I did it. I did it. Finally, I did it. We got the same animation on Kevin Love. You know what, bro? I don't know if it counts. It should count. It was a filthy dunk. Kevin Love fell to the floor. You know what? We can officially check off this level now. I feel, you know, good that we did it on Kevin Love and got the right player that we dunked on as well. You know what, man? Check off this level. Thank you. We get to move on. Man, I'm gonna add a guy that's from LA. I'm gonna add Paul George into the team. I don't know why. I just feel like he would look good in a Lakers uniform. And why not, man? LeBron, AD, and Paul George, it should be enough to win a ring alone. All right, guys, the next play we got is this full court pass into a fadeaway three from LeBron James. This is the one we're gonna try to recreate against the Wizards. I don't know how many tries it's gonna take, but let's hope less than the last one. We gotta make this full court pass and somehow hit a three at the same time. Okay, LeBron, step back for three. He drilled it, but it wasn't a fadeaway. We're not going to count that. All right, boys, here we go. This, I feel like, is going to be a perfect attempt. Kevin Love, we need to throw the ball down. Throw the ball down. Full court, okay? LeBron, it's not a fadeaway, bro. We can't count it. He's hitting these, but we can't count it because it's not a fadeaway. Guys, here we go. Inbound, all the way down to LeBron. Make a good pass, <laughs> and that was a terrible pass. Wow. Boys, it's got to be the one. I feel like I'm getting double teamed right here. I'm going to dish it to LeBron. Terrible pass, and another failed attempt. All right, boys, here we go. The pass is actually slightly perfect. He spins. LeBron in the corner for three. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Love. LeBron. And got it. Banks it in. I'm not going to lie. He caught it. He kind of spun. He took another step back. I mean, it wasn't perfect. Listen, it was not perfect, but he hit the shot just like he did in real life with about a second left on the clock. And hey, man, that is one of his greatest shots. Well, boys, with that challenge complete, we get out another player. And honestly, I'm going to go a little bit crazy with this one. We're going to add somebody that has been rumored to, you know, potentially join the Lakers in the summer. Trey Young is going to be added into the team. So we got Trey Young, Paul George, Anthony Davis, and LeBron. The team is looking really good. Let's get into the next LeBron challenge. Let's see what we got. Get to the next level. All right, guys, the next one is this dunk that LeBron had against the Portland Trailblazers. I mean, he absolutely destroyed Nurkic, and that is exactly what we were going to be trying to do. All right, boys, I don't know if we're going to be able to dunk exactly specifically on Nurkic, but the goal is to try to at least slam it on him. And oh, my goodness, bro. That was a pretty nice dunk right there to start things off. First attempt, but we're not going to count it because, again, he just didn't take off from that far. I mean, look, man, that was a pretty nice dunk. I do want to take off from further away from the paint. I want to take off from, like, 
one step in from the free throw line. Let's see if we can maybe get a screen going and switch on Nurkic. Come here, Nurkic. Come here, my son. Oh my goodness. That was filthy. I'm not gonna lie. He dunked on both of them. I don't know if I should count this or not, but he literally dunked on two guys. It's corner inside. He made use of Nurkic a screensaver. You know what, boys? That has to count. That just has to count because I don't think even if I sat here for an hour and tried, I could get a better dunk than that on both of them. He dunked on Dame and on Nurkic. That is just absolutely disgusting. That is just different. I have not seen that in 2K before. I mean, Dame was literally swimming on the ground after he got dunked on and Nurkic literally glitched through LeBron's body. I mean, hey, man, check out this level. That was filthy. Let's move into the next one. Ah, oh, boys, that might have been the best dunk that I've ever done in any 2K. We're going to go ahead and add another player to the Lakers to compete for that championship. Honestly, I'm taking Anthony Simons. I'm taking a Blazers player from this current day. We're going to add him onto the Lakers. He'll probably play off the bench. We probably don't need a point guard, but why not? Now, guys, this next shot is probably one of LeBron's most difficult shots that he's made in his career. One of the biggest shots he's made in his career. And it was a game-winning buzzer beater against the Orlando Magic back in the day in the playoffs. And, of course, this is a very iconic LeBron shot. We're going to go ahead and try to recreate this. Let's get into it. Boys, all we got to do is get this inbound perfect. We got Dwight Howard defending the inbound. We got to get LeBron off of a kind of a screen to come to the top of the key right there. LeBron for the win! We can't get it to go. All right, bro. Attempt number one already failed. I remember watching this play live and it was just absolutely mind blowing. Here we go. Let's see if we can get LeBron top of the key right there. LeBron for the win. For three. Bang. He got it. Over here to Turkaloo for the victory. There we go. That one was honestly pretty easy, but we get to check off another level. And I'm glad to have recreated that beautiful shot. Gets it to LeBron for three for the win. Yes. LeBron James at the buzzer. Listen, boys, another player we get to add. I'm going to go for a center this time. We're going to go with Carl Anthony Towns to pair alongside Anthony Davis. That should be a fun duel to watch come the playoff time. But for right now, we're back into the next level. Another LeBron shot to recreate. This one right here was a behind the backboard shot. Now, I'm not even too sure if we could actually even attempt or possibly do the shot. But we're going to try. Let's get into it. Boys, this is one of those shots that I honestly have no idea how to even go about attempting this. I mean, this might be the most difficult one we do. Let me just try to see if I could... Oh, okay. I didn't want to dunk. I wanted to fade out of bounds, but I guess I'll take that. Here we go. I'm going to try this one more time. I'm going to try to do it in a little bit of a different way. Maybe call for an ISO and then try to... Okay, that that is not good. <laughs> Boys, let's try this again. Same idea. Let me call for an ISO in the corner real quick just so everybody can clear out. I don't know what Chris Bosh is doing right there. He's kind of he's messing it up for me right here, man. I need to find a way to fade away out, out of bounds, I guess. So I'm going to try this right here. LeBron? Oh my goodness. Okay, you know what? That would have counted. I know I stepped out of bounds, but that would have been a crazy shot. Boys, here we go. Listen, man, I have the formula down. Now I just need to find a way to actually hit this shot. LeBron, spinning out of bounds. Oh my God, it hit the top of the backboard again, bro. I needed to go in. Boys, I'm gonna call it right now. This is the one, bro. This is the shot behind the backboard. Come on, let's go. I actually called it and it finally goes in, bro. Enough of hitting the top of the backboard. That is the one right there. Check off this level onto the next. Thank you. Teresa in trouble. Oh, from behind the backboard oh, boys we passed that level which means we get to add another player into lebron's team for the end of the video i'm gonna go ahead and just add zion williamson i don't know why i feel like him and lebron side by side would be disgusting to watch so hey man we're gonna add zion to the team and we're gonna move into one of the last levels on this list all right boys next level we got the absolute destroyal of jason terry by lebron james on that alley-oop slam so our goal is to of course recreate this let's jump into it all right boys now obviously i'm not gonna be able to do it you know perfectly identically to what actually happened in game but we're gonna try our best right here let's see if i can just hit lebron okay here we go we get our first opportunity kind of not really okay that was not a poster if he had dunked that over paul pierce i would have counted it but i mean we're not here for layups boys i fully expect this to take me a minute i mean we got opportunity for a you know self value right there but that's not what we're looking for oh right, boys we're pretty deep into this oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness that was close i'm not gonna lie if he had postered paul pierce once again i would have counted it but i mean uh, paul pierce didn't really contest and unfortunately it wasn't the poster we're looking for but still a nasty dunk boys lebron james oh my goodness bro he is literally throwing down everything that's like the seventh alley of this game but none of them have been posters god boys oh my god lebron lebron 
Oh, there was nobody back to contest him, bro. It was just an open alley-oop. I wanted that so bad. All we needed was somebody just standing under the hoop, and it would have been over. I guess Jason Terry must have learned his lesson because they do not jump, bro. I've been going for an hour, and this is the closest I've gotten. I mean, it really wasn't even that close because Jason Terry doesn't contest anymore. He learned his lesson. That's all I can say. Boys, I'm waving the white flag. I never thought that we would do this in this video, but I'm waving the white flag. It is impossible. They do not contest alley-oops in this game. I don't know what it is with this CPU, bro. It's literally unfixable. I've tried everything possible. I've been at it for almost two hours, maybe more than two hours, just throwing oops. So you know what, man? We're going to have to call it right there. We're going to go ahead and remove somebody off the Lakers team at random. <sighs> That's tough. We do end up failing a challenge like we just did this Celtics alley-oop Jason Terry challenge. We're going to have to remove somebody from the squad. So we're going to go ahead and take off the most recent addition. Zion Williamson is no longer a part of the Lakers team, which means it's going to be a little bit harder to win that ring. So yes, boys, the last level, we have to recreate LeBron's block from the finals back in 2016 when they came back from a 3-1 lead. That is the last step before we get to actually playing for a final. So here we go. Let's get to it. Here we go. The first attempt, Harrison Barnes. Oh my goodness. Okay, no block right there. Just a dunk, which Iggy should have done. It's about 15 minutes in. We got our first block, but for some reason, Harrison Barnes didn't drive in, so we couldn't pin him off the glass. Instead, we got a block on a mid-range uh, attempt. I don't know what that was, but hey, man, we keep going. Boys, we did it. Oh my God, what a block by LeBron. Curry back to Iguodala to the rim. Oh, great James. block. James out of nowhere. Boys, take a look at the block that sealed it all for the last challenge. LeBron got that ball absolutely out of here. He swatted that to like the 10th row, and that is officially going to check off our level 100 challenge and shot. And you know what? The last player we're going to add, I'm going with Anthony Edwards. I'm sorry, bro. I know we already have Carl Anthony Towns. We're damn near building the Timberwolves, but we're going with AE boys this is the team we ended up coming out with man trey young anthony edwards paul george lebron ad is the starting lineup we got a stack bench as well we need to win a championship or we're giving away a lebron jersey here we go all right boys the team easily made the playoffs we are the first seed we have the best record in the nba so i'm expecting to win this championship boys the first round was as easy as it gets a sweep against the warriors again second round pretty easy as well we swept the pelicans is our first challenge i guess you could say we lost one game against the mavericks we are in the final all we need to do is clutch up and win here we go the lakers versus the bucks in the finals we need to win this lebron jersey on the line here we go as we split the first two luckily we won the next two games so we are up 3-1 we have a commanding lead lebron please don't blow a 3-1 boys thankfully we hit most of our impossible shots with lebron we got through all of his you know top career shots and plays if you include that block and we are going to win this championship pretty easily of course we build a pretty stacked up team if you guys want to see me do this with a different player or a different you know team let me know down below in the comment section maybe we do it with steph curry matter of fact if this video gets to 350 likes we will do it with steph curry so leave a like right now and we're going to get a steph curry version of this out and honestly man if you enjoyed it let me know in the comment section hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel and i will catch you guys in the next one man make sure you check out the video on the screen right now and the NBA champions are somehow the LA Lakers. Shout out to them. They're going crazy. I mean, the team was pretty stacked, so it's a little bit expected.